let's talk about algebraic geometry. Algebraic geometry is a really beautiful field and quite a modern one too. It has numerous applications to things like number theory, elliptic curves especially, but it's truly a beautiful field in its own right. So what is it all about? Well, roughly speaking, algebraic geometry starts by looking at the geometry of sets of points where polynomials are zero. So it likes to look at the zero sets of certain types of polynomials. So in other words, we take some polynomial and we look at the set of points where that polynomial is equal to zero. So let me give you an example. Let's look at the curve f of xy equals x squared plus y squared minus one. And I wanna look at the zero set. That's where all the points um, where this curve is equal to zero. So if I set f of xy equal to zero, that's the same as looking at all the points xy where x squared plus y squared equals one. But we know if we try to curve the set of such points, that's just a circle centered at the origin with radius one. So this diagram corresponds to the zero set of this polynomial. Now in algebraic geometry, we wanna consider a slightly different problem. Suppose I'm given two arbitrary polynomials f and g, say. Now, obviously, these two polynomials are very, very horrible. These things are almost impossible to graph. And suppose I want to know, is there a way of looking at these two curves, these very horrible curves, and finding out exactly at how many points they intersect? Now, it turns out that there is a way. It's called Bezout's theorem. And that's going to be the big thing we want to try and work towards. Now, Bezout's theorem basically says that the number of intersection points is equal to the products of the degrees of these polynomials under some constraints, under some assumptions which we need to make in order for this to be true. And we'll look at some examples where that statement actually fails. But to get there, we'll first have to introduce the notion of algebraic sets and algebraic varieties. So in this series, I won't really be doing very many rigorous proofs. The point is just to get you to understand and realize some of the most uh, basic concepts in algebraic geometry. And if you want to learn more about it, I provide an online book uh, where you can read about it. Uh, it's Algebraic Curves by William Fulton. It's completely free to access on his website. Um, and it will help if you have some familiarity with things like rings, ideals, integral domains, etc., etc. A lot of basic concepts from uh, a course in abstract algebra, say. But I'll try to provide a summary of these concepts as we go. So that's my introduction to algebraic geometry. We'll see a more elaborate introduction later. And if you liked what you saw, please leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe to my channel so you can stay updated about more videos just like this one. Thanks for watching.